What's going on guys, I'm Crocker Trail SK of Sofa. So today I'm going to review a game of mine. So you can see this is a ranked game, you can see the ranks and so on, whatever this has been played. Go up to actually. I have no idea how a platinum you know, four players are in the game, but whatever. It showed me like I'm um, bot lane, but I'm actually not. But right now, right here, you can see that it is a ranked game. To give you a little bit of spoiler about the game, we actually got a throw, but not really. So you can see I'm top lane, I got ignite, and whatever. I'm playing KO against Poppy, and it seems like. Yumi wants to stay on me. You can see I'm playing his finger. Right now I'm coming to the game. I was somewhere. My own, my own business while well, the game was loading and I come back. And Yumi is on me. What's that is doing, dude? And the player just told me he wants to win. And that is the fourth. He's going to support me. And I was like, oh my god, dude, why are you trolling? And so on. But in the end, I was like, well, I lost the last game. I don't want to lose this one as well. And I'm like, whatever, dude. Do whatever you want. Just don't troll. I want to win. I'm going to refer to the player as the cat because he she doesn't matter or the support yeah. The support I just say that I want to win also. And you can see going aggressive and I'm just going to follow up. Make sure this is not an int. It's like I think I'm going to use she because more of us are using me, but I don't know. So, it seems like she did not want to win, she just wants to pop, pop in. And I was like, well, we have the numbers advantage, the bigger wave, so... Whatever, I'm going to get the best out of the situation. I'm not going to in throw to get mad. And there is nothing I can do about it, so whatever. I'm just going to deal with it calmly. You can see as here I am safe farming, but at some point I realized wow, why am I safe farming? It's just poking them, getting around the lane and so on. Just win the lane. Normally it's not that good. Because Kyo needs a level. But well, it's not that bad. At least I was going to get items. Okay, we see Warwick. And I'm like, Hope is low. What can we do first? I'm like, back enough. So they fight in our minions. She exhausted. We're going to attack. Flash. In and. Right here, I'm gonna back off for the minions to finish him off, but Greg said finish him off. Right here, I want to push the wave, get some solo experience, but Poppy decided to teleport. And today, I'm going to retreat. So, Yumi told that she did her job well and is going bot lane. You can see Bane in the bot lane. He's just safe farming, AFK farming, trying to not feed. So Yumi comes, they go in on the aggressive, I was actually watching them. Okay. And right here, Vayne just entered this play. Vayne says, my bad. I don't know. And so, Yumi said, 
that she is going to come back up. She doesn't seem to trust Ben, like at all. But on the other hand, I am winning pretty hard. And I know how to play. So I just decided to stick with it. It's not a problem. So again, 2v1. I'm gonna go on the aggressive side again. Just towards. And also there is a thing. If we do not eat, we are actually going to win due to this out scanning them. And, and I mean hard out scanning them. Scale, Anivia, Fane. Yumi is actually a pretty great scaler. So is Gragas in the team fight. Gragas can one shot the whole team in the late game. Because all this damage is a Yumi. So you can see I'm just sipping from it. There is no need to be so crazy, but Warwick comes, so I'm going in on Warwick. We already won that when we were on a disadvantage. Talking about levels, we were at level 2. They, had, they both had one level on us. So it's all even levels. I'm a hit, hope he's kind. I killed Sport. Was the word that can't happen. And do it, just went in and killed Warwick, taking it in. him behind. You can see here I see him poking on both of them. Because uh, we both hit more range than Poki, so we should poke him. You can see any of you got so killed, that's not a problem. You can see the stats and everything. Well, this is going pretty great so far, you can see. And yeah. Drag is soaking XP. Okay, just so one second. Okay, sorry about that, uh, my snowboard one was working for some reason. Uh, that was really bad mistake, that you got to kill. And I am the top lane, level 6, and now I'm ranged. I tried to dodge it, but I didn't. So we're talking about Poppitos, she can run away. She can be pretty slippery and extremely fast. And Jimmy was pumping in me to go in, but I just said no. Let's hope she's fast. If her level, she can run away. And we left it as dead. Oh my god, dude, this guy does a lot of damage. So, oh my god. You can see Bart is roaming. A quick spoiler. Bart is coming top lane. And we get an island. I saw Bart, I went in immediately. But Warwick. Try to at least kill Bart. Didn't work out. Gregus. I think he get out. No, yeah, he didn't. And Poppy gets a triple kill, which is a big problem. For sure. Like, a triple kill to Solar. 
She's going to be stronger than us, but actually not. To be one, I help you hopefully. You can see the farm difference, it's just huge. Well, we can't farm because I'm going to pop her down in the mid. Anyway, just check here. You see, even if we don't win hard and we just throw the game out, we are still going to win into the, in the late game because it's just the out here. You can see I saw them committing to a play, so I'm going in. They got barred, so I'm just going on my relay. Finishing her up. And here. Trying to get Poppy, Yumi got the shutdown, not a big problem. We got her, and right here I said that I shouldn't try to kill the turret because of the bonus resistances. Dragon Slayer, so I'm to kill Hero, and of course I'm going to kill. What do you lose something here? And actually, I call third. No, actually, I'm not losing third. I thought I lost one. Oh, so Gregor lifts it to me. And I'm going to use it immediately, top lane, because the turret is in a hit range. You can see Pop channeling her ultimate. I'm just going to run away. I tried to run her down, but she's just too fast. Bot lane and mid lane are present, so I'm not afraid of anything. Now I give a lead. There's no need for me to be afraid. Just poppy poppy. Fighting her because we are actually stronger. And you can see Warwick coming. I want to check Warwick, test the ward. To know if he is actually going in. I got jumped out pretty far right here. It was pretty stupid. Okay, Ben is dead. So we're just going to push. Again, see for himself. Ben is just for her. But she is so on 2 and is. Oh, and 3 actually, and it's safe performing, so. There's. Not. Something that bad. She's going to kill anyway. I'm going to kill. I want you to be hard. So you can see Poppy stop my recall. I use the blast gun to get her back to us. Which is extremely smart play. Okay, wait a better reloaded, but I couldn't do anything because the Poppy passes hit me. This auto attack built around 400 damage. Just on my level. But I was like, who cares? I have a lot of gold on me, I can just buy an item. And right here, top wave is going to bounce back, so I'm better off going both lanes. And in the bot lane, if we win the fight, we're getting a lot out of it. So why not just go bot lane? You need to go in vain, speed her up. I'll take the minions, the movie away. So they're starting fighting. I know they're going to go to break it, so I just go to him immediately. And then for more. That was actually one of the best condemns I have ever seen. 
Pop is going on me, so I'm going to get back if there is an enemy. You know, I just don't want to die. I just shot a lot of damage, so I'm going to get. So here, you see the tower. But at the same time, I see the top wave. My tower stuck is done, but actually, I was going to get top lane too late. It's extremely sad, but whatever. We are still getting a tower. Finishing this way. And the recurring. Man, that was a lot of farm that I played. Just so you know, guys, getting all this farm was actually more worth it's time and effort I'm amused Actually, Yumi coming to support me was just the best decision ever I wouldn't want to support this thing either But at this point you can see Anivia, but I am fast, Grace is doing great. Mate, you miss him doing great at all. Score wise at least. Okay right here, I want to push but you see if our enemy is missing? No. I'm just going to get the crux of their vision. And not bother anyone. Getting the perks. Okay, I'm going to show for a moment. We can do the lane, but the moment I show top lane, they turn around. So I'm going to work through here with another control. Oh, actually, he missed it. I remember clearing the world into sweat. Here, fighting for you. Actually, pretty stupid considering the card game is missing. But, well, my team was here to follow up, which was great. That was really lucky on me. We killed the members, and we're going to get a third pick. And for the top. You can see already we have almost 6k gold leg. Right here we just get to run away, but I saw them getting you. I said, turn around. If the minions were under the tower, I was going to go in and win the fight, but actually the tower fought me, so I can do anything. I just want to run away. Right here. Just the part I mean... Bart has some damage. And also, if I was 1v1 against Fokri, I was probably going to win. You can see I'm getting gunplay because of healing. The item is also great to kill for healing for yourself. And also, great burst. Healing, just everything. It's great. Every AP seems to have some sort of feeling, else it's not that great. And just looking at them, coming to bot lane, I know that they're going to fight, so we should go there and them. I got first back. But doesn't matter, we won the fight. The flash. 
when I am the Kremlin Aggressive and if this was... I don't know actually maybe Diamond because the things like going over aggressive and the enemy team just bursting you down for a split second then continue on the day why back to the race like anyway don't really happen still how I but if they happen, yeah, stop it play. So we get the star, continue pushing. Really, Chris pushing top lane. I mean, at this point, they kind of know that they have lost. We all kill them. We won the early game. We are just annihilating them. So I thought, yeah, we should push both lanes, but the next moment I realized, wait, that's Carol, we can just end. There's no stop us. And at this point, they just surrender. You can see what the brutal dog lead we get. And yeah, that's how you handle trolls like that when the support wants to come top lane. I myself was pretty amazed that we actually won and we didn't just win, we just annihilated them. And you can see the whole game. Just brutal, man. And you can see these achievements. I'm just fucking lit, man. I'm just fucking lit. Drink a man. bottle of this shit, man. Bottle of this shit. I'm about to write a hit, man. I'm about to if we got that tower, it's going to get quit, okay. Never gonna quit. So, I hope you guys like this non traditional video. It was pretty fun for me to play the game and also to reveal the vault. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. I have a lot of games like that that I don't record because sometimes when you record you just don't play well. Subscribe for more content like that and see you guys next time.